A man has to go to the uh, system and then he has to switch on the lights and switch on the systems. So, so many times he forgets and due to that lot of power is wasted and we need lot of manpower to control so many streets. And one more thing is, you may, we can switch off whatever the lights you want and we can switch on the whatever the lights we want. And this is a, with this we can save manpower and as well as uh, electricity power. So, it also indicates the uh, failure lights status. So, so many times we are seeing that uh, so many if the light is fails, the persons will replace him so, after so many days. But with this system, instantly, instantaneously the electricity board will get information about the failure lights. Now here, the demo you can see here, this is the main control system here. This system will control the lights as well as the give the information about SMS. Now, these are the starting messages after reset the circuit. Now let's check the GSM modem status. Once more, if the SIM is there, it will uh, show that message. Now these are the triac board to control the street lights. And here we are going to show seven lights. And with this help of this circuit, we are detecting the failure status of the lights. Now coming to the controlling section. So to switch on the lights, you need to enter the message in a specific format. The format is one for to switch on the light and zero for to switch off the light here i am going to show the format so type your message so in the first case i am going to switch on the all the lights so you have to put all ones in seven places enter the, the receiver number you can change this format also for providing more security so you can add some passwords like that that's not a big issue now you just press send as soon as you sending this message you can check the message if it's your side so once it receives receive the message it switches on the, all the street lights and it also sends reply back so you can check the feedback message lights have been controlled successfully so Suppose if any light fails, it automatically sends the information about that light. Now for demonstration purpose, we are removing one light. Yes, you can see here. Now we are removing one light. As soon as the light is removed, it, it immediately detects this system and it will send the information about that. Waiting for the you can see the message light one is fault so immediately you have to go and replace that light like this we can check the all the lights now we are also removing the second light and we got a message light two is fault and if you want control only few lights now we will show the demonstration for that also So now I'm, I'm controlling alternate lights. So this is a message format. So zero indicates switch off the light, one indicates switch on the lights. 
So it depends upon your requirement, you can switch on the lights. I'm sending that format. You can see the output, only few lights have been switched on. So this application like this you can control in the midnight where you require only half of the lights and where you require center lights you can see the feedback message lights have been controlled successfully. Thank you. Thank you. ES Tech Center.